Hi, everybody. I am super excited to be here today. Um, it's 9.30 in the morning on a Wednesday, so we're on St. Patrick's Day. We're at Hump Day, so we're really excited to get the opportunity to talk here at One Million Cups. Um, I want to thank everybody for coming and all of my friends that are going to help me online and all of my friends and new friends that are going to be here. So let me take a second and introduce you to TechServe. So TechServe is a, is a technology company that is based around the hospitality industry. So we are where technology meets hospitality. Technology is best when it brings people together. We are, again, we're the hospitality industry and that's what we do. We connect folks, we make things work. So what I wanna do is give you a little bit of background about TechServe and how it came to be and give you a clue about our story. So about 16 years ago, Scott was our IT director and he was the IT director for a local company here um, that was called Barbecue Management at the time. And he was the IT director for Sunny's Barbecue, for Mojo's, for NAI Heritage, and then recently for Jeremiah's Ice. As that company continued to grow, we added Willis. Um, Willis became our service coordinator and focused on hiring the team and being on site. At the time, we were still an internal IT company for a really large organization. In 2019, iServe was formed. So the company of barbecue management reconstructed everything and said, let's create silos for our companies and gave Scott the opportunity to create his own tech company. So by being its own tech company, we now have the opportunity to service the outside companies. So as we continue to grow, we can service other brands. So we continue to support our original clients, but now we are now expanding it. So TechServe was formed. So in 2020, we began to service all of our outside companies. And in 2021, I came on. So I was a general manager for a Lake, the Lake City Sunnies. And that was a three and a half million dollar restaurant. I had done it for five years. So when I tell you that I know the hospitality industry, it's not a bunch of bull. <laughs> I've been there on Fridays and Saturdays. I was there through the nights and weekends. I've survived remodels through the COVID, through all of the different caterings, all of the things that are involved in the hospitality industry. Something that if you're not familiar with hospitality, 50%. Anybody got an idea what 50% is? 50% 50 of our business in the hospitality industry is often done from Friday at five to Sunday at three. So when we post on social media, I heart weekends, there's usually a little bit of sarcasm involved there because um, it's definitely a love hate relationship. We love our customers, we love our clients, we want people to come in and take care of them. Um, but when you say, it's finally Friday, we're like, oh God, it's finally Friday. Uh, so we are ready for the weekends and we're prepared for it. Here's the problem. While we're dealing with this volume, while we're taking care of all of these customers, while we're taking care of all of these clients, and our technology would go down, our systems would fail, our POS would happen. This was the message that we got. Are you kidding me? We are out of office. When I need you the most, I can't find you. I get the please call back Monday through Friday from nine to five. So for the 16 years that we were the internal department, we really focused on doing things ourselves, learning that processes, being hands-on, and knowing what we were doing in that industry. So, this is us, where technology meets hospitality. Technology is 24-7, and so should the support. So, talking about what we do, we do restaurants, we do hospitality. 
we do the service industry because that's our bread and butter. We know how to do those things. We know point of sale systems, we do printers, we do touch screens, tablets, computers, music, TVs. We are a one-stop shop. You don't want to call 15 people when your stuff goes down. You just call us and we'll take care of it. It's all got to work. Every single piece of technology in a restaurant, in a hospitality, works together. You notice if the music's not on in a restaurant. You notice that if you're at a hotel and you can't connect to the Wi-Fi and you've got a business meeting to go to, it's all got to work. But it's all got to work together. So we continue to expand our services into networking, security systems, cameras, remote access, and what we call back office. Why are we different and how are we different? We really are restaurant people. All of us came from that background. When we say, when somebody comes up to us and says behind or hot pan, we actually know what that means and we get out the way. So it's important that people understand that there is more to the technology in a restaurant, the type of equipment that you use. It's got to have the ability to survive the heat. It's got to be able to handle cleaning the floors in the hotels. It's got to be able to get everywhere. It's got to cover the whole building. We understand what it means to be in the hospitality industry 24 seven. Our clients are 24 seven business and so are we. We have one rate. We do not charge extra to come out for you on nights and weekends. That's when your busiest time is. That's when you need us. We're not going to take advantage of that situation. All of my guys, they work the nights and weekends. They all have a shifts. We take care of our clients that way. So we've all been here. We want everybody to know that help is just a phone call away. We have a number that you can use. It is 352-482-1999. You can check us out online at techserve.support. And if you just want to talk to me, you can reach out to me directly. And this is my cell number. I answer this. I take texts on it. You will get me. And if I don't get you right away, I promise I'm going to get back to you because it's our job to be there for people. So my questions for you guys are, how do we best service the Ocala industry? How do I best get in front of the hospitality industry? And is there anything that you're seeing that you want to know more about or that you're like, why are you doing that? Because um, I would really value the, the feedback on it. So thank you guys for your time. This is TechServe, and I am Margie. Please let me know how I can help.